To create the carrier, we start with the HIV virus that is broken down in the laboratory and reconstructed using only certain parts with the therapeutic gene within it. This is our gene therapy vehicle. At this point, blood stem cells are taken from the patient's bone marrow. And these cells are cultivated for a few days in the laboratory before the virus, modified by us, is added. This enters the cells and inserts the therapeutic gene in their DNA. The cells are then reinfused into the patient, returning to their marrow, their home. And here they begin to generate other cells that pass through the bloodstream and spread throughout the organism. The offspring of the cells we have altered leave the bloodstream and arrive at the brain, where they set up home. And here, not only can they assimilate the waste material formed in the patient, but also release part of the functioning enzyme, which is captured by other cells that in turn become able to assimilate waste material and correct their defect.